Yo, what's good with y'all, man? It's your boy, David B. I'm back at it again with another reaction video, man. We got Cadet Daily Duffy, man. We're getting into this reaction video, man. But first, I'll leave a like, subscribe if you're new, turn on post notifications, help the channel grow. Appreciate the love support. Everybody that's rocking, man. We're going crazy. Roll to 10K. Follow me on IG and Twitter. The links are in the description, man. Appreciate the 7K, man. Simple as that. <laughs> I'll repeat it today. Stretch it out real quick before you go crazy, man. You already know. None of these niggas can look me in my face. Mmm. Oh. Hmm. Hey, clip. Clip. Yo, this this shit already hard, bro. I know. I even gotta explain that power line, bro. If you seen power, you know. Simple as that. Damn, bro, bro, that is so. Hey, this some clever ass shit. No, he went there, though. He went there. That's tough. Shout out gigs. Huh. Oh, okay. Okay. Bro. He, he clever with this shit, bro. Hey, I'm clever. Can't relate to that bar. But I know it's a bar. Hey, if an old nigga hating calling Joe Button, man. Look, that nigga said I run a nigga down like Joe Button. <laughs> huh. Oh. 
Like Sam Mabel, I don't know. I know we can't shut down the wave just by saying his name. No, I don't know. No, I get it, I get it, no. No, I get it, I get it. Man, call it Cadet. Dope, man. It's simple as that. Like, it's no knocking his talent, bro. Like, you can't deny that he was talented, bro. That's, he was going, he, he definitely left before his time, though, bro. Like, this man, he would have been, he would have been something serious for real. I'm just mad I ain't hear about him until he passed, though. That. That's the crazy thing, bro. Like, but shout out to the people that did put me on to him. Sweating for you, so make sure you enjoy this thing. Uh, ah. Simple. <laughs> All right, y'all. That's the end of that, man. I'm gonna go ahead and do his uh, closure track. Boom. Pain. Underrated legend. Pain. 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 I'm gonna lie, this is all true. It's all true. It's dope. Yeah, facts. We finna go ahead and go crazy then. Trip on high. Look. So a big part of my life has been chicks. I know I can't lie about that. And if I keep it real, whenever I fall again, I'd have to lie about that. See, word, I was still in. See, I fuck with his storytelling scheme. Like, yeah, I already heard the song Stereotype. I seen somebody request that, matter of fact, yesterday in the comment section in one of my videos. Somebody put Stereotype. I didn't re back, reach back to him and say, like, I already did a reaction video to it because a lot of times people do comment uh, a song that I already reacted to, and I do respond and say that, but, man, it began tiring doing that, bro. Like, just saying the same thing over and over again. Like, oh, yeah, I reacted to it. I reacted to it. I reacted to it. So, it's just, if you don't see it, I mean, I don't know. I might have tucked the video down, but I have heard a uh, stereotype by him. That that was deep. The stereotype track was definitely deep, bro. I fuck with the storytelling, bro. Just words, them scars weren't closed up. But since it gave me exposure, it's only right I told you my closure. Slump. Man, I was so rude to the page. So rude to the extent that when I even use real names, Sharishi texts me once and I'm at him. Tara kind of treats me like a German. The girl that done the monkey bar thing well. But well, she's just doing her, man. <sighs> Not the same one that my last three hours about, but love from west to the south. Four hours over the game until I saw her out. There's a video of, of him, like, I don't even use Facebook. I don't even know why I got on it, but I had got on there and I seen, like, a video of him that was going viral and shit, bro. Like, I was like, damn, that shit crazy, because I don't know. It's crazy how I'm seeing him now that he gone. Because, like I said, I was on Facebook and I see him. I'm like, damn. I probably seen him on there before, just never clicked on a video and shit. But I seen that junk going, like, it's going viral or whatever. It's like him sitting down rapping. I don't know what he was. I don't know the title of the song. This shit was dope, though. I've been thinking about this girl like every day, in every way. So, yeah, of course, we speak in numbers exchange. And now I'm happy uh -huh. as fuck. Because now I'm back with the love of my life. Doing all kind of shit. Like kissing on no four heels to a clock at night. A good guy now, I ain't hit him or never. Even catch my car spitting together. You know what? Kiss is perfect. Come that puzzle pieces fitting together. That's when I told that way, though. And for doing this, then we gotta do this right. Bro, storytelling shit really dope, bro. Really just how you gotta piece it together and really make it like, yo. Then on the finished product, you're like, yo, this shit dope. Nigga just told me a whole story over a beat, bro. I'ma tell you all the shit that I've been on the last couple years, the shit you won't like, but I'ma be honest, then. I'ma be rude to the T. I've got to make sure some next girl can never come to you about me. And that's oh. when I started talking, when I told her all of the girls that I beat, all the problems with me, the one night stands on the girls that I met on IG. But, but you already know them type of girls gonna come in the picture, bro. Especially since... He a big artist, whatever, man. I know he passed, whatever, but I'm saying, like, I'm just speaking, like, in general now. Like, you a big artist. All the girls that you was dealing with before you got, you know, you tied down, they're going to come back in the picture like, yeah, we, me and him, we did this and that. They trying to fuck shit up, man. That, that's just pretty much what it is, bottom line. Turn all the problems with me. The one night stands on the girls that I met on IG. But it was her turn. She said, there ain't a dream I can sell you. I'm mm. my life's been boring. I never ain't nothing to tell you. Oh. I might not believe that. Maybe I was naive. Or well, after the girl I was thinking about for the last four years was by me. And like that feeling that weren't gonna wait. And the mummy would took us on the holiday. Now I'm deep in the nine going easy and shit. Couple months and I got the key to the crib. But, but then I got distant though. Cause I got that iffy vibe like. I be catching about to them silly lies like Okay If you're my woman Then why I gotta catch you up And it's dumb shit That shit you ain't even gonna lie about And this is when I turn into a fuck boy And when I can't lie when I just went with it Even though I was huh. them They made him turn Hey He said he turned to a fuck boy after that And this is when I turn into a fuck boy And when I can't lie when I just went with it Even though I still love them man Something couldn't see for my spirit mm. Never called a beautiful 
once. No attention, her time had none of it. I'm all some do pull up on a late night random one. If I felt like cuddling, that's when I got that phone call though. Okay. And you know how it goes, like like playing. That's how you should know. I just took a pregnancy test and I look man, it came back positive. Bang bang number can't have an abortion. Looks like we just gotta get on with it. I mean you oh, can't man, like, hold on. Hold on, hey. Now this shit getting deep right here. Bang bang number can't have an abortion. Looks like we just gotta get on with it. I mean, I can't lie how I acted. It was all loose when I started backtracking. When I heard the word baby, I just panicked and asked him again, are you sure you wanna have it? And she said, mm. the doctors told her before that she can't have a baby. So the thought of having an abortion, no, no, having a you is all crazy now. Look, see, when a baby ain't planned, there's some stages you go through as a man. The first stage is, mm. no, she ain't having a shoot. I gotta talk to her harder. The second stage is, Look, man, I got him enough because I'm gonna be a father. Pull her off, I still told my mother. Real I'm shit. Just to... That's some real ass shit, bro. Yo. This man, the truth. Look, man, I got him because I'm gonna be a father. Pull her off, I still told my mother. I'm thinking that she's gonna get mad at me. All she said was blame. Do not bring a mad girl in my family. Told my sister what she went having. I'm right now, I'm excited. But anyway, fuck that part. It's the second part that hit me like life. I got a phone call out of the blue like blame where you at. And can you come round? And I said no. And she said no. So I said, fuck it and go from south. Blue until I pulled up to the crib. Got in the lift, put the key for the door. And all I can see is her there. With her arms around her belly on the floor. I'm like, yo, baby, tell me what's wrong. She's saying I bled and my belly keeps hurting. I keep falling in the ambulance over and over again. But the shit ain't working. They pull up and what seems that forever. Me, I'm shocked. I don't know what it means. We get to the hospital, take her blood. Holding her hand, waiting to be seen. And then we get to the hospital, take her blood. Holding her hand, waiting to be seen. And then. Some young white lady steps in. She clears her throat, she looks up slow and says you're no longer pregnant, man. Oh. But it kind of hit me in a worse way, cause it happened like three days before my birthday now. Now me and mm. that's back on track, but I can't lie, we'll sure I ain't giving it, cause I got this feeling saying that I can't trust her. I look, man, I can't get rid of you. Man, I got to talk to her. I got to talk to her. say he got a, he said he can't trust her. I look, man, I can't get rid of you. I'm like, well, sure, I ain't giving it because I got this feeling saying that I can't trust her. I look, man, I can't get rid of it. Man, I got to talk mm. to her. I got to talk to her. I'm going to see her next week. And that's when I'll talk to her. I picked her up so I could drop her at the airport. I said, I'm tired so she can drive. And I'm just there in the passenger seat. And I'm, and I'm looking at her square in her eyes. And I say, What am I about to say, man? I ain't trying to cuss you. I really want to make this work, but I feel like I can't trust you. I look at her what it is, but I got a feeling so deep in my ribs. At least she spoke on it, though. At least he spoke on it. Some people, they just keep on going with it, bro. And then it be like, you know, when something like eating you alive, bro, you just hold it in. You don't be saying nothing about it. At least he said something about it, right? Telling her he don't trust it. Like, hey, that's the first step right there, bro. You got to, if you don't, if you feel a certain type of way, man, you got to speak on it. Don't be bottling it up. I feel like I can't trust you. I look, I don't know what it is, but I got a feeling so deep in my ribs. Months ago, you was gonna have a kid, and now I feel that the solution is to let me have a look in your phone. It might sound dumb and it might sound young, but let me have a look in your phone. Mm. Don't get it twisted, I'm grown. But let me have a look in your phone. I'll see nothing, I'll stop bugging, we'll get to trust him, we'll build something. You'll probably be cussing like I told you there was nothing in my phone. Yeah. The word of my life, I'll let that you already know. Hey, you already know how it's gonna be, bro. Like, I like how you, bro, I like how you put this together, man. Like, I told you there was nothing in my phone A word of my life, I'll let that go But let me have a look in your phone And then she said no And I said, what? Mm. I swear you want me to take you serious A word, that's what I'm trying to do So you've got to respect how I'm trying to move Trying to move Five years deep, you'll let that go Just to not let me look in your phone Five years deep, you'll let that go Just for me not to look in your phone Now that's that's real Like you on, you really know Sacrifice five years because like if a nigga can't if he don't trust you it's a reason why I mean people not gonna just sit there and not trust you for no reason you did something for somebody not to trust you So hey if he questioned like I said it's a good thing he's speaking out on it though She looked back with a woman and scared face and then she said no one look you see that kind of iffy when I let that go so quickly still went to the airport just to let her off and then I put my key right for the letter box look what was in her phone man I would never know but nine times there was the maddest things in her phone mm. Now, I get a phone call two days later She's like, hi, I'm like, what up? She's like, now you can look for my phone I'm like, doop, doop, shut up Three months off, so I'm in short Actually, I want to know how the female feel now About, you know, hearing this like, I wonder how she feel now About all this shit She's like, now you can look for my phone I'm like, doop, doop, shut up Three months off, so I'm in short And I see her cousin 
And she pulls me to the side like I wanna talk to you about something. And I'm like, can't we can step out the box? I mean, you can go speak in the car. And she's like, I don't talk to my cousin no more, man. She takes things kind of far. And I'm mm. like, wait there, what do you wanna say to me? And she goes, um, shit. I don't have to say this, but I don't really wanna say no dirt, but when you was with her, huh? she was chatting to a couple men. I never this guy from work. And when she was having this kid, she showed up to my crib, car. Sure, like if it was yours or his, and I said, Wait, oh, I know. Damn, that's fucked up, man. She wasn't sure, like if it was yours or his, and I said, Wait, there, how do you know? She said, I'm gonna do his life, I know, and, and I'm only telling you because I don't speak to her anymore, and I couldn't care about the cheating. But the child, she hit me harder, and I got excited and all told my mum, and I might not have been that father, but I guess I didn't know that lady after the miscarriage, shit got crazy. She looked back like miscarriage, what? I said, Yes, yeah, she miscarried my baby. This is a deep ass story, bro. Yo, this this it's crazy. We both went to the hospital and they said that the child won't have anymore. When she said, when this happened, around the end of Feb, I said, yeah, how you know? She said, fuck, man, this girl's a drip. I said, wait, what do you mean? She said, I'm a dude his life, I'm talking. But in the middle of February, I took her to get in the bullshit. I said, yeah, fuck like that. Yeah, man, fuck up, but man, fuck up, say fuck like that. Mm. Are you even clock in the play? So the miscarriage and her being on the floor was all staged. And then they asked why a man so bitter. A man turned into your average nigga, saying how you can't trust these Ooh, women. Trust hold on, man. bro. Hold on. Yeah, he he really he really talking some facts. Some facts, bro. That's why a man so bitter. A man turned into your average nigga, saying how you can't trust these women. Trust me, boy, man, they can't get rid of. But if I learn one thing out of this whole thing, you gotta go with your gut. But you ain't gonna take my advice because I'm just kidding, aka the slut, you feel me? Hey, I like say so you gotta go with your good feeling, bro. When you feel something, like feel a certain type, feel a certain way about something. Hey, go with your gut feeling, man. Nine times out of ten, you might be, you got that feeling for a reason. Now that was real, bro. That closure. Damn, that was a deep, deep ass like message. It's a message in there, and on top of that, it's a real story. So, hey, he had, he putting y'all on game right here, bro. If you just listen, he putting you on game. Like what he was saying, like towards the end. That's why men turn bitter. Like all that is a reason why niggas be why people be a certain way that they are. I ain't gonna just say niggas, man, but you know, it's a reason why people be a certain way. Like something caused it. It ain't like mother just well, alright, I'm gonna be this way. Some cause it for the most part, some cause him to be that way. But yeah, this is the end of the reaction video. I go ahead and leave a like, subscribe if you're new, turn on post notifications, help channel grow. Appreciate the love support. But that's rocking, man. We going crazy, bro. The 10k, follow me on IG and Twitter, the links on the description. It's your boy David B, man. And I'm out.